time for a little payback. The Contessa, having escaped us in the prison, is now hiding out in her castle estate. It's a well-fortified, gothic nightmare that would make any thief run in terror. Terrible or not, that's where we're headed. To sweeten the deal, we've learned that the Contessa, who until recently was a secret member of the Claw Gang, is in possession of the Clockwork Eyes. The Thievius Raccoonus describes the eyes stopping opponents dead in their tracks, transfixed in their gaze. It doesn't take a genius to figure out what an accomplished hypnotist could do with such powerful artifacts. News of the Contessa's corruption has spread to Interpol. Constable Neela, being closest to the case, was granted a cash allowance to hire an army of local mercenaries. It looks like we're walking into a full-scale war. But we have to act now, before things go from bad to worse. Hello friends, this is Kevin aka KMN1 coming at you with another episode of Sly 2 Band of Thieves. In the last episode, we managed to break Murray out of prison, but the Contessa managed to get away. And in this episode, we are going to be storming her new base. And first things first, I just want to go ahead and point out, uh, one of the new power-ups you get here is Paraglide. It is a required power, and I'm going to be picking it up right here because it's incredibly useful. You just use it by whenever you're in the air, you press the R1 button, and you just start gliding, and it's awesome. photos around the area. Then make your way up to the re-education tower. Looks... pleasant enough. Oh, and stay clear of tanks. You know, so you don't get blown up into little sticky pieces. Alright. And the first photo is going to be right over here. And you want to avoid the tanks as much as possible, obviously. Just because getting blown up is not fun. Neela's made a headquarters out of that old bank. It's a pretty secure location. It'll take some doing to drive her out. Alright. And we gotta work our way down over here for the next photo. Um. The Contessa has these boats out on patrol against Neela's army. They could be useful to hitch a ride. And, yep, there's a guard there, and I knew he was there, but I was really bad about avoiding him. But, anyways, with the paraglider, we have a lot more navigation op options open to us, and it's great. And it's one of those powers where it's just, like, after having it, but then, like, starting a new file and you don't have it for a long time, it's just really painful not being able to use it. But, that's not a problem anymore, because now we have it. And we can just climb up here for the next photo. Our luck. All right, and this is my first time recording in quite a little while, um, just cause a bunch of different things um, with IRL stuff happening and my recording software just kept giving out on me for no particular reason. Um, I just kind of had to put recording down as a lesser priority, but I'm back in the mix for right now, and hopefully I'll be able to get. A handful of videos done ahead of time uh, so that I'll have a nice little buffer again for I just gotta wait for the blimp here that's the blimp the Contessa used to escape from the prison maybe we could use it to our advantage around all these high towers okay, yeah um, it's always best to try to record a couple episodes in advance when you're doing a let's play just cuz um, Having having those few days where you don't necessarily have to record anything in case stuff comes up is always going to be very handy. Um, and real quick before we go in, there's going to be a clue right here, and I'm just going to going to go ahead and grab it. Um, the clue recording is actually the clue thing is going to be recorded on a separate file, um, just because of the way things kind of worked out with recording. But um, just so you know, that's where that clue is for when I'm collecting them in a montage. Bentley, there's more than just the clockwork eyes up here. Why are you doing this? Neela, she set me up. 
I'm an honest cop. Of course you are. I've read your psychological profile. I know that you're honest. Then why are you doing this to me? Because, dear, you're honest. You see, by chasing after Sly Cooper, you learned too much about the Claw Gang and its spice operation. It was only a matter of time before you figured out that I was a secret member. So, when Nila gave me a chance to put you in custody, I took it. Coward. You're a disgrace to Interpol. I'll make it my life's work to destroy you. Oh, I'm afraid your life, let alone your life's work, isn't going to last much longer. Once I integrate the clockwork eyes into this device, your life's work will be whatever I tell you. I won't be brainwashed that easily. Quite right. It won't be easy. Or painless. But I will reprogram your mind, and you will take the fall for me at Interpol. Now, just stay back and relax. Go to your happy place. And stay there forever. I don't think they've seen you. Take a few photos and get out of there. No. I've got to help Carmelita. She's in trouble here. There's nothing you can do now. Get the recon photos and come back to the safe house. I swear, we'll find a way to help her. Interesting. Inspector Fox is restrained in an old Iron Tech 250. Crude, but effective. The clockwork eyes! They seem to be routed through that control board. Get a shot of the console so I can decipher its make. Those are the Contessa's elite shadow guard. Tough is too sissy a word to describe those guys. That's... That's a mind shuffler. I didn't think they were real. It's made of equal parts science and black magic. Indestructible to conventional weapons. That old terminal should be hardwired to the systems in this tower. We need to find a way to get it online. All right, head back to the safe house and we'll get a plan together. The war between Neela and the Contessa has put the castle on high alert. To get at the clockwork eyes, we'll need to subtly manipulate this conflict to our advantage. Here's the plan. Murray, sneak into the castle and kidnap the head of security. I want to ask him a few questions. Meanwhile, Sly and I are going to get a little paranormal. I'll slip into the crypts beneath the castle and put together a bad mojo bomb. It should be enough to destroy the mind shuffler. Slot, you capture a few local ghosts and drop them into Neela's headquarters. Hopefully the near-death experience will inspire her to purchase more mercenary firepower. We've all got our assignments. Good luck.